Hey everyone, I'm Dave Betts from the Smart Home Services team. We've had a lot of success in the field with developed mesh Wi-Fi system, a product that plays an essential role in the connected home. So we wanted to hear from some of our top techs to get their tips on selling Velop to the customer. First, let's talk about key indicators. What do you look for in the customer's home and how do you introduce the need for the Velop? I start by trying to take a look at see you know how their their internet is set up, how they're how they're using Wi-Fi, whether they're using a, a gateway modem with their internet provider, or if they're using booster systems or something like that. A lot of times, folks say that they they're paying for one speed, but they're definitely only getting uh, this much. I'll let them know about Develops, and I'll let them know that um, you know there's an app involved with develop system that will allow you to you know do tests on the speed, check the speed right away. You kind of take a look into what they currently have. Half of the time the customers don't even have dual Wi-Fi bands. They still run off of one Wi-Fi band and the devices themselves aren't capable of handling too much. And the cool thing about develop is that you get this device and it's actually capable of handling all these devices. The signal strength is far greater than a lot of other wireless devices that are just basic. I look for how many devices they have. Seeing how large the home is and seeing what kind of Wi-Fi solution they already have. Um, and then when I bring it up, I ask them if they are happy with their current Wi-Fi, if there's any dead spots in the house, and kind of go from there. If they already have an existing range extender, ask them if that's you know uh, working for them. Um, see if they like switching back and forth from different networks. Those are some great strategies. When you enter the customer's home, keep an eye out for factors that could be slowing down internet speeds, such as video streaming or online gaming, and explain how these factors are impacting connection. Also, look for Wi-Fi boosters or extenders, or just ask the customer where they experience poor connection in their home or even dead spots. Then explain to the customer the ways in which Velop can help. Another key indicator is the size and layout of the house. Building materials and home layout can obstruct signal. Look for cement or brick walls. Also look for opportunities to offer multiple nodes for the optimal whole home experience. But of course, you're still going to face objections. What are some of the challenges you come across and how do you overcome them? One objection is definitely the price. Customers, what they do, they, they Google, you know, you know, they'll check on Amazon, how much it is on Amazon. And the first thing I notice that comes up is you can get a pack of three for I think it's like $300. It's like cuts the price in half. But it's really, really important to realize that those those Velops are actually um, the, the dual band. The routers that we sell, the, the, the Velops that we offer are actually um, three bands, meaning that there's two bands for you, for the customer, and then there's one single band uh, for the Velops themselves to pair to each other. You know, it's, it's important to realize that. You're going to get customers like this that are going to have a problem with the price point. However, the one thing you can do and the one thing you can certainly make sure that you do is plant that seed in when it comes to selling this item. Once you introduce that conversation about internet speeds and if they're having issues, they're going to unleash. They're automatically going to start venting about their internet if they're having issues. I'm like, yeah, it's slow. Oh my God, it's this and I just can't stand it. And you can take that as the goal and you start saying, hey, well, I have a device here that can actually relieve a lot of that trouble. Once they feel that they need it, they're going to do more than just give it a second, just give it a, a, a single thought on it. My number one objection is price. Um, the way I overcome them is I explain all the benefits, tell them that I am there today to install. Um, they don't have to purchase it from you know, Amazon, try to figure it out themselves. I connect all their current devices. I walk out the door and they are 100% done. So as you heard, price is probably the biggest objection you're going to face when selling this product. Helping customers see how the Velop will improve their daily lives is key to building value for their purchase and overcoming the price objection. How can you do that? Emphasize to the customer that Velop is the backbone of the connected home. The average household today has 10 to 20 smart devices connected to the internet. But what's the use of having a home full of smart devices without a network fast enough to support them? The Velop system will remove dead spots and buffering while delivering full Wi-Fi bandwidth to every corner of the home, 
even to devices outside, such as doorbells and cameras. That's a better customer experience with less stress. But let's go back to a couple of the top selling Velop techs and hear from them. What advice do you have for technicians who haven't started selling Develop yet? Or for anyone who's struggling with selling this product? One really key point that you want to take away is the fact that when you're using boosters and you're using extenders, you're cutting your signal in half. Um, this does not do that. This is not a booster extender system. This is a, a router system, you know, a multiple router system that piggybacks off each other. It's really not going to be a hard thing for you to figure out how to do this. So if you're afraid of selling it because of, you know, overcoming an objection to the price, just let them know about it, show them the app, you know, let them know that you can, you can almost, you can confidently say that it's pretty much going to give them faster speed than what they're getting right now. All I can really say is honestly, just give it a try. Just give it, there's nothing, there's nothing to lose. Um, just give it a try, go to a customer's house, look at the device. It takes maybe, maybe a, a minute just to go to their modem, just to look at their wireless setup and stuff like that. My advice would be just start offering uh, because now nowadays more than ever, you know, people have more things that they're connecting. Um, everybody's streaming, everybody's doing this. Uh, they want to have an unbuffered experience. All right, you heard it from the best. Every single time you go out to a customer's home, try to find a different opportunity where you can integrate VELOP into their life. Thanks for joining us and thanks for all that you do.